It's the All Blacks against Ireland in their second test. Andrew Mertens gets the game underway with a wobbly drop kick that is well handled by O'Kelly and uh, takes it down a little bit soft on top here at Eden Park after a lot of rain in the last couple of days as uh, Stringer gets it back and uh, the first kick is made. Yes, it's, it's a matter of this all back time side to nail, nail the coffin. Shut, nail the, the final nail the coffin. They got a bit of a roll no on ball, there, no ball, wait, wait. Oh, That's Leo Khan on a jersey 18 for Malcolm O'Kelly for Ireland. As my records tell me that's his debut. This boat. I need you to give way to the good And of course, uh, there are man short in the scrum well too. So oh, the All Blacks. Oh, oh we've got to see a good old fashioned push over try. There, it would be. And he's always so evident when Ireland are competing well. Absolutely correct. I think Robertson's been a lot better at the base of the scrum. Here goes Holler. Holler straight through. Big moment for Marty Holler. And O'Driscoll very slow to get up back on halfway. The restart with still uh, just under five minutes remaining. Ireland with 14 players. Here's O'Driscoll. Well, he's well recovered. Look at this. What a tremendous player he is. Frees it up to Hayes. Fiji. Stay bound, Black. 40 points to eight. The All Blacks have come back emphatically in the second test as Ireland look to finish with a flourish. Here's Bishop. Bishop getting close to the line. Referee looks down and he hasn't quite made it. Lost it. And he lost it. Lost it forward by Green. And that might be the end of the game. Lost it forward. Indeed it is. I think it yes. Well, it's not on by Green. All Blacks have come back at Eden Park after a scratchy performance at Carisbrook. They've hit back tonight by scoring five tries to one and putting Ireland away by 40 points to eight.